since day one. The food's been great. I found these really cute bananas, <laughs> which I think are very appealing. <laughs> so it's day two, and I think I've fallen in love with some tea. This rather taste tea. <laughs> Cool, so we're about to peace out of the Peace Center. It's been a great time, but I want to show you something that I personally am a huge fan of, and it's this thing right here. This fan, I'm now certainly a part of its fandom because it has saved me from the heat. Needless to say, I'm a huge fan of this fan. Yeah, so day four, we're here at our home stay. And personally, I like to think that these, these days are just kind of cycling through, you know what I mean? Like, these days are just, they kind of like fit together so well. I kind of feel like I'm on an endless cycle of adventure and I love it. Day five here in Sri Lanka. Uh, we're about to leave our homestay and everybody here is having a big cow that we're leaving, but everything's going to be bow fine in the end. You know, they're going to be fine. We're going to be fine because it's time for us to move on. Oh, some cows. So it's day six here in Sri Lanka and there's still plenty of things left to see. Uh, there's an ocean of opportunity just waiting for us everywhere we go for pictures and video and all kinds of interviews. Um, we're just really ship shape, ready to go. You know, this really floats my boat and I just can't wait to see where the rest of this trip takes us. So it's day seven. We just climbed Sagiria, also known as the Lion's Rock. And let me say that this place rocks. Like, I don't know if it's written anywhere or set in stone, but this giant boulder is a very nice boulder. I just want to let you know that we're here. I'm not lying. This might be the lion's rock, but I'm not lying. It's a good place to be. It's very beautiful. And I made it. Cool. So here we are. It's day eight in Sri Lanka. We are at the Botanical Gardens, and it said on the sheet, bamboo. So I thought there would be a panda here. But when I got here, I felt bamboozled because there are no pandas here, and it's personally causing me pandemonium. I don't know if I can bear the weight of this bamboozling on my soul. So, I do love the bamboo, the gardens are very beautiful, but, man, I wish there was a panda here. Day 9 here in Sri Lanka. Things have been going pretty swell. We're getting to the end of our journey, and I have a lot of bottled up feelings about it. Um, but what I really want to talk about is today we got to go to a cultural center and see a dance, and that dance just got me all fired up, you know what I mean? I just, I really felt a flame arise in my soul, something that could really just keep me going for the next couple days, you know? I feel like I'm marching to the beat of a different drum now. So, all in all, today's been a really good day. I mean, every day's been a really good day. I mean, how can it not be a good day? I'm in freaking Sri Lanka. Cool, it's so a day 10 here in Sri Lanka. We're here at the Elephant Orphanage, and I gotta say that it's very elephant here. I'm having a good time watching the elephants bathe, you know. It's one of those things where it's like, there's a lot of junk in the trunk they gotta take care of, but they always manage to take care of it, you know. Elephants are just Elephant. Just very, very cool animals, you know. Very elephant. Doodle do, motherfuckers. <laughs> cool. So it is the last day. We are here in the Chicago International Airport, and I just have, I have to say it plain and simple that we are heading home today. Um, this trip has been fly as hell. I've enjoyed every single second of it between the awesome elephants and all the Buddhist images we've seen. I can't even begin to describe to you how great of a two weeks this has been. Um, it's been so wonderful in so many ways that I can't even begin to describe how I feel. It went in shock. But this is, has to be my last log. So you know what? I'm here in Illinois. So Illinois, let's make some Illinois. It's time to go.